So guys welcome on back to my channel thank you so much for clicking my video and if you are new welcome on in my name is Simawala and wherever you are I hope your day is going well I just want to thank you for taking time out of your day to hang out with me so we are going to be taking a look at a couple of mods we're going to be taking a look at some gameplay mods aesthetic mods mods that make your game look good some functional objects and these are the mods honestly these are the mods that you didn't know you needed until you put them in in your game i'm here with my cane family they always help me out with these mod reviews and today we are going to be having a good time with the family and showing you all these wonderful mods so if you're ready let's get it let's go all right first up is the flat style icon pack by Diskit. With this mod, it changes the appearance of your Sims 4 phone icons to a flat style by Diskit. With the Simich language to create the illusion that it would be an app that you would see on the phone if it were a Sim phone. <laughs> so basically, um, any of the old icons are definitely changed. If you have any of these added mods like turbos wonderful whims wicked whims snb bank um some realist uh real estate the foster family only sims uh base mental drugs uh, lori nice mods expanded pregnancy mod they have the new flat style icon so i like this it changes the aesthetic of your sims phone and it's cute so go ahead and get it and download the next mod is the baby pose interaction mod by simply on wanta we'll just say simply a and with this mod you are going to actually use your brand new baby sim um we usually have them as objects but with this mod you get to do the cutest little thing you get to take a picture with your newborn baby so i'm going to show you guys exactly how this works you click on the bassinet menu will pop up and you click baby pose and the parent or whoever you have selected will come in and take a beautiful um array of different poses with your newborn baby i like this mod because it gives me a chance to interact with the newborn baby instead of immediately aging them up to infants so go ahead and download this mod guys you won't be disappointed this next mod is called the Real Readable Romance Books Mod by Sim Kara. I love this mod. This is one of my favorite mods ever. I have this mod in my game. I will keep it in my game. If you are anything like me, I mean, I am an avid reader and I love romance. Ooh romance books baby we get 50 50 romance books they are real books taken from the real world um you can get it as a merge file or separately let me show you guys how it looks in game so the books are all here in the game i just used a bookshelf just a regular bookshelf from the game i click purchase books and they are all here i love it it showcases the title even tells you who the author is it even gives you a brief description of the book so my girl is gonna purchase this book here and uh we're gonna read abby has her copy of the confessions of allegedly a good girl and she is gonna have a wonderful read in her romance books i love it guys go ahead and download this mod this next mod is the Selectable Playable Pets by Charity Codes. And I want to give a quick shout out to my friend, Kasserine. Kasserine has suggested this mod to me um, a while ago because I was struggling trying to figure out the needs of my pet for my pet sim. Um, I love the cats and dogs um, pack, but it's just that you can't play with them like you really want to. But this mod definitely gives you the chance to do just that 
now that I have the mod in, I can actually see my Sims pet's needs. Um, there is his picture. There are all his needs. He needs to go to the bathroom, but he most of all, he is starving, okay? <laughs> he is starving, so now it's so much easier to go ahead and see what my pet needs and just take care of them the way that they should be. I mean, this is how we should be playing with our pets. Guys, this is how it should be. We should have our pets included within the family. I mean, if you're feeling the way I'm feeling, then this mod is the perfect mod for you. It allows your pet to really be a part of the family. Look at him, he's eating. All right, guys, this is a mod, the old but goody, but this is a mod that you really need, but you didn't know you needed. <laughs> this is Fogarty's Hidden Highlight Mod. Okay, so with this mod, it changes the highlight that surrounds your sim or any objects that you may be touching in the game. This is an aesthetic type of mod that changes the way your game looks. Um, so this is going to come in handy. Of course, now I have the mod in and I'm going to show you. I am touching my sim. No highlight around them. I'm touching the object. I'm touching the child. No highlight. So if this is what you need in the game, you know, especially if you um, are filming something or taking pictures, you don't want the highlight. So get this mod. All right, guys, this is for the simmer who loves to keep Things simple. This is the simple dog mode main menu by Simmatical. I love this menu. I love how it's centered. I love that it's dark and sleek and really has that rich color. If you want it even darker, it's a darker version, but I just love this version. It's really nice on the eyes. And if you still want your packs and your kits, you can get them available on the side. There's nothing else to distract you um, on the main menu. But if it's too dark for you, they also have a beige mode main menu. Perfect for those who likes to keep it light. And if you're wondering, can you still keep your purple UIs and pink UIs? Uh, yes, you can. These mods do not conflict with each other. I test it out. Everything looks good. I can have both and be very, very happy. Now, if it's just too simple for you and you want to elevate it up just a little bit, go back to Simmatical's um, Patreon and download the Refresh Main Menu. Guys, this is the movie time option. Now, you only can pick one. There are several other options. You have um, a classic menu where there's like four other choices. And then you also have the yes this is the classic one you also have the warm vibes one too where there are five more choices or yeah four more choices listen many many choices for you to choose from go ahead and download one of these mods by sim manically this next mod is called the Instant Cast Story by Vicky and Chen Yu. Um, this is a really great mod if you want to create a sim, um, but you don't have time to uh, play through their life. So you're going to have a couple of choices that you can only do while you in cast. It's the convenience of it all. Um, so you get to give them a career, you give the give them a degree and you also get to give them some skill all right guys i'm here with my sim brianna and um i'm gonna quickly show you guys how it's done and i know you can use mcc command to basically do all of this but you can't do it in cast and it's just a matter of saving you time and the convenience of it all so we have the cast story skill and you would click that and then you would select the skills that you want your sim to have and then um after you select all of that then you could go into the career and then you can also do the um degree so we're going to go ahead and we're going to start selecting for 
the career and degree as well. So I want Brianna out here, my sim, to be in the food world. So I want her to have a cooking um, job or a critic's job. I want her to be okay with either or, um, but mostly the critic's job. So I'm picking the critic's branch. She'll have that as a promotion. And then as far as the degree goes, I do want her to be very well established. So I want her to have two degrees. One, of course, for culinary and then the other other one for um, maybe let's do literature and we're going to do literature and now we are going to go in game and then you'll see how everything is okay so here she is she's in game as you can see she has a promotion she is within the critics branch and then also here are her two degrees the culinary one and then we also have the uh literature one so that's how it is guys it's just really simple it's really easy it saves um you on time and yeah so go ahead and download this mod it is the um instant cast story mod by vicky and ching yu all right guys my king family it's about to have a good time this is the volleyball beach functional object mod i love this mod it's so much fun i love anything that could give my sims more activity okay i place this down on a beach in totosa it is in your build by objects um of course look for the wrench because it is cc um and yeah and you just place it down you have your sims click on the net and you pick who you want to play with and you just have a good time this is by warwick cc go ahead and download this mod this next functional object is also by warwick cc this is the hammock and it comes in different um swatches it's in your build by um section it is a cc so we'll have the wrench in the corner you just click on the hammock you can place it in between trees or whatever you want to place it and just have your sim come and relax nap sleep do whatever they want to do they are loving it they are in the hammock and it is fantastic go ahead and download this object this next mod is a really cute one i love to use this um this is the paper sketchbook um, mod by ravishing um it comes in an assortment of different swatches and you know if you know anything about ravishing you know that when they make their mods they make it for um your convenience it's they make really great mods that just makes the gameplay so much easier and so much fun um so yeah this is a great mod to have if you don't want to have a big old easel or a digital sketch pad you just want something simple pretty much old school um it's a nice way you know for your sim to get out of the house and just have a really chill relaxing moment as you can see my sim is sketching on her sketch pad and it's just um part of a way that my sim can do uh, an activity and um it's really, really cool to see. You know, we love old school. We love the old school way. So, yeah, go ahead and download this mod by Ravishing. All right, guys, this next mod is called the Always Welcomed mod. And this is by Please Say Psych. This is a mod that gives your Sims the Always Welcome trait. So, you know how it is when you go to a friend's house and they're always saying, This is inappropriate. Please stop. Well, this will prevent all of that. I mean, when I play, and I know when you guys play, we like a little bit of realism. So I feel like if you was to go to your friend's house or your bestie's house, you know what I mean? And you're there helping them out and you want to cook, they're not going to say, uh, hello, this is inappropriate. So we don't want it in our game. So if you want that to stop, Go ahead and download this mod by Please Say Psych. It is the Everyone is Always Welcome. It is a trait. It will appear in your um, traits section in your Sims menu. And I just love this mod. It just helps out so well. And your Sims can just hang out with their besties and have a nice dinner without being yelled at. 
Okay guys, so this next mod is called the Fantastical Play Vug and it is by Ravishing. This mod is so convenient for your toddlers to come into the room and play. It comes in a different uh, assortment of swatches for you to choose. You just place your rug wherever you want it. It kind of takes the place of the dream home. Decorate a big tent. If you have that game pack, you know what I'm talking about. The tent is huge. It's big. Yes, it could be downsized, but sometimes it's just awkward, you know? You can't see your toddlers playing. If you wanted to take a good picture. So, this rug really comes in handy. It has the same functions as the tent. You just clean Click on the rug the same exact way you have your toddlers come and play by themselves or with a friend or with a sibling and it's just that easy. I love this mod. We love ravishing mods. It's so convenient. Look at our cute little toddlers. They are adorable. Go ahead and download this mod for your gameplay. So this next mod is more of an override. It is the Rose Override, and this is by Jessica. Um, yeah, and it's really, really cute. You um, just click on Romance Flirtation, and you offer a rose. And instead of the basic rose, this one is wrapped up with a bow, baby. <laughs> Literally wrapped up with a bow, and it's just so so freaking adorable there is nothing else to say but go ahead and download this mod so this next mod is a real handy mod this is by little miss sam it is called the auto brush mod it's a small mod just put it in your mods folder and you have two options you can have them auto brush after they puke or auto brush after they puke and eat. I chose the second option because it's really convenient and really nice for when your Sims are eating and after they eat, they go ahead and they brush their teeth. Now, my Sim just finished eating his grilled cheese sandwich. He's gonna put his dishes away and I give or take about 10 to 20 seconds after he's gonna brush his teeth. Now, please keep in mind, I did not set the kitchen sink to the kitchen sink <laughs> so it, it, you know this is not his fault this is my fault um please don't mind him but he is definitely brushing his teeth at a sink so yeah so i have to change that but it's so convenient you know usually we have to manually tell our sims to go ahead and brush their teeth and wash their face and all that good stuff so this mod like i said it's very convenient it's the auto brush mod by little miss sam go ahead and download this mod all right guys this next mod is by boss lady tv and this is the flavor coffee you could just take any coffee pot from the game base game whichever um coffee pot you want and here are your options now you have a multitude of flavors so um the flavors are amaretto french vanilla hazelnut irish cream mocha and pumpkin spice coffee um you could brew a whole pot or you can do a cup he's brewing a whole pot of the amaretto coffee and i love this um mod it just gives um you know extra flavor <laughs> extra flavor to your coffee and you really don't have to get a whole like food type of mod you know what i mean it, and you don't have to like download any special type of coffee pot you could just use your regular coffee pot that is already in game and my guy over here he did get a moodlet from having that flavored coffee it says amor amaretto ali could really go for another cup of amaretto coffee right now so yeah so that's cute that's nice i love it so go ahead guys and download this mod by boss lady t the bonus it is the cuddle and bath mod by klaus listen guys thank you so much for hanging out with me today and clicking my video i just love and enjoy so much talking about mods and giving you any information that i can um if you are new please hit that subscribe button give me a like if you want to um comment below which mod you will be downloading today come on back because this channel is very active i hope you guys 
guys enjoy the rest of your day. My name is Simo Lala. This is my Kang family, and I'm signing out. Bye, guys.